What up, YouTube? Your boy Sugar Hill, right? Alright, so I'm cutting some vinyl, right? And what we're gonna do, we're gonna press it on the truck I have. Now, what we're gonna do right here is we're going to take the paper out of this hat. We're gonna press it for about 20 seconds, but we're gonna do lower heat than usual. Alright, so what I'm doing, I'm holding on to the hat versus giving it that aggressive press. Um, the less you press, the, the, you know what I mean, the less pressure you use, the, um, the better it's going to come out. I also lower the temperature. Um, now what I'm about to do right now, I'm going to press it again because I'm trying to get it right where I want it. And I'm just holding it. Just watch what I'm doing. Alright, so now I'm about to grab the vinyl and I'm about to adhere it to the hat um, it's gonna come up now and when, it, when I bring it up the hat is gonna be warm but if you had pressed what you could have did was pre press the bottom of the platen so the platen could be warm and if the but the bottom platen is warm or the rubber part I'm talking about it will make your hat adhere much easier now peep this little trick that I'm about to do I'm going to attach the hat um, to the to the uh, to the bill based off of the heat that I already had. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the top of the hat and I'm going to rub it. I'm going to rub it on the on the um, the top of the heat press. You're going to see what I'm talking about in just a second. All right, so you see I'm adhering it, but watch what I'm about to do. All right, so I'm going to fold the hat up. I'm taking the hat and I'm just gently rubbing it on there. So basically that's making it stick. This is stuff that I do. You don't got to do it, but let me tell you. Uh, I probably did hundreds of hats. Very minimal, minimal um, pressing marks. And if you see that, you see that black uh, mat on the blue heat press, that's a silicone mat. I have perfected this technique so much. I barely use those silicone mats or pressing pillows to like raise the top part of the hat up. Now most people will do that, but I ain't gonna do that in this video. I'm doing this to show you like troubleshooting things that you could do um, to make it easier for yourself. It could take you a little longer to press a hat than normal, but the thing is, if you use less pressure and less heat, it takes longer, but peak game. The trick is, you're not really gonna have no marks. And if you have minimal marks, like, um, like I said, what you could do is you could take an easy press or a heat gun and press the back. But look at the hat. Do you see any marks? You do not see any marks. Hi, right, man. Thanks for watching. Hope this helps you out.